Hi Tooligans, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all doing well. It's been a while since I've done a review now, so I'm going to be doing one on the Vito TAXL BX, which is the tool apron extra large box. So the box stands for box pockets. So here we have it, guys. This is the tool apron. Um, you've got your obviously normal good Vito quality material. You've got your nice leather embossed um, Vito logo on there. You've got a tape loop by here. All of these pockets, this is a deep one there at the front on the breast pocket. That's nice and deep. And then you've got all of these pockets here. You can pop pens, pencils, any sort of uh, marking kit in there. So it all fits in there fine. Tape loop, that goes on nice. Doesn't feel over um, balanced when you've got the apron on, which I'll show you later. Um, it doesn't, you know, fall forward or nothing. Moving down then, you've got these deeper pockets, one either side, and then you've got a central pocket. You've got these smaller pockets as well. And then you've got your hammer loops, either side, so you can have it left or right, wherever handed you are. And then here, you've got your box sections. So these come out in one large box, or you can have two individual boxes in the one or neither. So you've got a setup of your own. Same on this side as well. So you've got your boxes that come out, slide back in, back in the apron. So you can either just have your one box, or you can have your two boxes, however you want it. One thing I will try, with my Stanley Fat Max box. If I was um, doing work, um, using screws on something, uh, multiple, you know, repeat job, same thing over and over again. You could probably take out the, these, just pop them straight in there. Um, saves you taking them out, put them in there, empty them back in, you know, it's just an option. So that's just giving you a rough guide of the Stanley Fat Max box. It won't fit the bigger ones in. They are a lot deeper, but not to worry. Like I say, these are obviously supplied with it, so it would just be for speed or freeze, and for packing it away, you didn't need these in, you could just pop straight from um, your storage organizer. Pops in there. And then, obviously at the back of this material, I call it ripstop material. It's just stuff um, we used to use in the army on our um, jackets. It was like this ripstop. Um, obviously with a stitch in the weaves, it would only tear so many, you know, it wouldn't just rip straight through. It's got that catch every uh, every movement. You've got your strong straps and your strong material with a bit of flex in it. So you've got your adjustable um, clips. This one thing I'm not too sure about is this, these drill loops. When you wear it, which I'll show you in a moment, it bows out, which might be a good, good thing, might not suit everyone. But um, I've seen a few people who have taken these loops off. Um, totally personal preference. Totally up to you, whatever you want to do with it. Um, but I've seen one or two on YouTube and they've taken them out. And so, and you've got your center pocket there, and then you've got more areas for your pencils, um, extension bars for your um, impact drivers, any marking up stuff, pencils, yeah, you, you, you know what I mean. What I'll do guys, I'll pop it on and I'll show you what it's like. Very easy to pop on, minimal faff. On it goes, and there you have it. Sorry about the leg in the way. You've got your box pockets. And obviously through there I can feel the drill loops. So if you if you've got one of these or you use one, 
let me know about these drill loops because I don't know I think they're just bulk up there I suppose it's handy if you just pop it in to do something you can take it out um, like I said earlier clip the tape on it's fully adjustable so you can tighten it up as you're working also I bought this for doing a bit of renovation um, it's ideal for if for me when I was laying the deck in I could just pop all the bits in there and just keep going along doing the deck in um, just makes it a little bit easier and that's it guys that is the TA XL BX BX box so I'm going to be doing more reviews guys on um, some more kit I'm going to be doing some more bag reviews um, I think on the next one is going to be the Tech XL Wheeler and the Tech XXL I'm going to give them two a review and a load out video um, but it was just a quick one today just to keep the channel going on the TA XLBX um, hope you all enjoyed the video hope you like and subscribe to the video put your comments in guys if you've got one of these if you use one of these what you use it for whether or not you bought it for um, a small job or if you use it on a daily job so let me know your opinion on it um, and obviously I've been doing a little bit of um, work in my little shed so I've been um, just popping things up so I've got my wear around of drinks on there pop my MB2 up my DRLC which I keep in here popped a little line bank of plug sockets in there they run under and over to there see me stretching anything else over there I pop my screwdrivers up there I've just got some spares and some bits and bobs in the toolbox